a comprehensive guide to implementing internal requisitions and internal sales order cycle in R12. In session 14 of the demo, we should confirm the internal order. Click the start demo button to commence the demo. For this session, we use the order management super user responsibility that comes seated with Oracle applications. This responsibility gives the user access to all menus and functions within order management and shipping. Earlier, we had PIC released and PIC confirmed this internal order. Now, we will ship this order so the material can be sent out of organization M1 towards organization M2. The line status and the next step confirm that this order is ready for shipping. Any documents required for shipping can be associated to this process at this stage. This will be dealt with separately under order management. The interface trip stop has completed successfully. Now we can review the material transactions. We will retrieve the material transactions using the details of our internal order. Transactions represent the material pick confirm event. This transaction shows that the material is shipped from M1. Let us review the accounting distributions for the ship confirmed transaction. As a result of the ship confirmed transaction, the material account of the staging sub inventory gets credited. The in transit inventory account defined in the shipping network of organizations M1 and M2 gets debited. The dollar value of these transactions equals the quantity shipped times the item cost 
as defined in the shipping organization, A1. This brings us to the end of this session.